Hi guys and welcome to another special squad builder for myself, Bateson87. Now, this week's team of the season is Serie A. So, as per usual, we have got a full team of the season Serie A squad builder for you. Two players are out of position, but they do play the role very well. Um, also, this squad is very, very fucking expensive. Well, actually, it probably has dropped considering the time we did get it. Uh, I think all, all most of the players are below a million coins, which is one positive from this this week's team of the season for sure. Right, so let's crack on and show you some of the players. Well, not what would be the point of showing you all some of the players? I need to show you all of them for you to understand how good this team is. Especially at the end, you'll realise uh, why I've like fallen in love with this team so much. So let's start off with the goalkeeper. No, let's start off the bench. Right, you got Borja Valero. This was a fuck up by E. I don't have any idea why they did re-release -re that card. Absolutely pointless. Uh, also, guys, go and check out Thief Coins Online for your Ultimate Team Coins if you want to get any uh, Ultimate Team Coins. Their link is down below. We've got this guy, Legitch. Alright, Legitch. This guy looks fucking random as fuck. Four star skill moves look quite good though. Uh, you got Basta as well, ignore him. Lichtenstein, Marchetti. Now, I'm going to put a goalkeeper in this team. Buffon. This is the guy who I've been playing with. But to be honest, I'm going to show you some clips uh, in the second part of the video. And honestly, you will not be putting Buffon in net. You'll be doing this and doing a straight fucking swap for him. Putting a 3-5-2 card on him and leaving the team like that. But for the purposes of this video, because this is a team we did use, we do have Buffon in net. But I really do not recommend you go and purchase him. He is the worst goalkeeper in the game. By a long shot. He is worse than any bronze keeper I've played with. Worse than any silver player I've played with. Worst keeper ever. Yeah. Horrendously bad. Right, defence. Left from uh, centre to left to right. So centre is going to be Barzagli. This guy is a god. His normal card is highly rated. But this card is fucking awesome. The only de uh, thing wrong I have with the defence is the pace. It seems slow. But if you look at all the pace, it's all above 70. So that's a bit of a strange one with me. It might be the work rates. You lot might say in the comment section below why it's like that. But it does feel really fucking weird. Um... For the left-sided defensive midfielder, we're going to go with Hamsik. He is originally a cam, uh, but to get him in the team, I wanted to play with him. So we had to move him down to DM, and then we got the three strikers uh, from cam to the two strikers. On the right-hand side, we have Vidal. Uh, this guy is fucking awesome. Absolute rock solid. Better than his normal... Well, all of the cards are better than normal cards, bar Buffon. Right midfield, only 5 star skiller, it's Lemilla. I have had his inform card, but this card is ridiculous. You can do scoop turns, you can do roulettes, you can do fake shots and chops. It's ridiculous, guys. If you are a budding FIFA skiller like myself and you want to score clip goals but fail miserably, then this is the guy you want to be purchasing. Well... I didn't purchase him, I borrowed him, but that's not the point. If you do want a player like that to make you feel good, to make you feel like you, you can be R9 Rai, then Lamella is the guy you need to go and purchase. Uh, you can take that tip from myself. But if you're just a roulette and you like to do an odd flip-flop now and then, you have got El Sharari Mari. He is a right, left midfielder. He is awesome as well. Both of these players are class. I'm hoping that that rating is very similar to the one he will get in FIFA 14. But knowing the year, he will be an 83, 84 rated player. Which is a shame because he is... Uh, well, I don't even know what he's like in real life. I just go off his FIFA thing because in real life sucks, doesn't it? It's all about FIFA. Yeah. Awkward. I am sad. Cam. Di Natale. This is mine and Itani's fucking love child. If I, if this player got my good looks and Itani's long shots and like, tight fitting t-shirts and stuff, this would be what it looked like if I had hair. Um, we put him at cam because we wanted to put two beastly strikers up front. So on the right hand side we've gone with Cavani and uh, who is generally a shit player. His pace is fucking nuts though. But generally he is a bad player. Me and Nitani absolutely hated his in form. His second in form. He, is, <laughs> he was one of the worst ones we've ever played with. But this card's very different. Uh, it might be because of his strike partner uh, who is Mario Balotelli. Um, did I like my Italian accent then? 
come at me. Uh, awesome player, and this is an, an awesome attack as well. Balotelli, this squad builder, guys, may as well be Balotelli and friends because this guy fucking carries. He is a tank, and he's that good that I will be doing a player review about him because I just fell in love with him. You, If you're in the stream, you would have seen how easily I was getting through with him. His strength, his finesse, his shooting, his skills... He is just the perfect striker apart from his dipshit haircut on his card. But I can let that slide. I can really let that slide. So, guys, that is the full team of the season um, Serie A built. Hope you have enjoyed it. I'm not going to show you the highlights of me beasting and feasting. And also Booth on making an absolute dick fumalit new word there. Probably won't make it onto Urban Dictionary and that, but uh, we, all we can do is try. Right, so I'll be back in a sec, guys. Hi, guys. We're back now with the highlights. And to be honest, after playing this game for, I think I played five, six games this on stream last night. Maybe, no, seven, actually. Uh, Balotelli. Phew, he is hands down the best team of the season player I have used. He's up there with the likes. Well, I highly rate 91 Messi, uh, but Balotelli, honestly, his positioning, his strength, he's just absolutely ridiculously good. I didn't like his normal card, but this card... He fit the build perfectly. I will be doing a player review about him for sure because I've fallen in love with him so much. I can't tell my fiance though because if I tell her that I've fallen in love with a black man, she will hit the fucking roof. Uh, seeing as we're from up north, but nice individual skill here from Balotelli and sinks the ball in. That was the type of thing he was doing all night. Uh, I was basically sperming in my pants. It was messy. Uh, I ran out of Kleenex, it dribbled onto my concrete, it's left a right fucking stain. Uh, but unfortunately I'll have to clean it up tomorrow uh, because I haven't got time today. Busy, busy, busy. Um, but yeah, the team played as a whole really good. The only letdown was Buffon. The defence was a bit slow, but that might have been down to me playing Hamsick at CDM. It might have caused a bit of trouble. But this team of the season is class. Go and try every single player if you can. If you can't afford it that's unlucky but you will be able to at some point in FIFA 13 that's for sure and when you do get a chance Balotelli is the man to try he is so so good um, and he won a lot of games for me so guys if you have enjoyed this video remember to leave it a like comment in the section below about what team of season players you use got impacts what not tell me I will uh, try and reply to most of them anyway uh, remember to subscribe if you're not subscribed as well check out FIFA coins online for your ultimate team coins and remember to check out all the live streams we'll be doing with some team of season players coming up soon so thanks for watching guys and I'll see you again